you can go out for a walk in your neighborhood and then you can just look around for the houses that you can spot. It brings like hope, like a little more hope to um, your neighborhood and, and yeah. That's Ruby, she's 10. <laughs> and she's out hunting for clouds, which is today's theme in the front window scavenger hunt, as the neighbors around here call it. Ruby's mom, Michelle Beaton, is the organizer. I guess I would consider myself a glass half full type person. I have two kids and so if I'm sad, they know. And I don't want them to feel sad, so I have to keep positive. <laughs> now at first it was just one of those ideas to get her kids to do something. Then it took off. Now lots of people in the neighborhood decorate their windows. And Ruby will tell you that the best part oh, there's some clouds. is checking out what other people have done. Uh -huh. Like it shows that people care and like they're showing you that they're, they're fighting. Yeah. Like Ruby's neighbor Jennifer Katz and her kids. We get a lot of people walking by and laughing and enjoying it and that gives us some pleasure even though we can't hang out with our neighbors. It's like we've brought them a smile. Who made these? Did you make those? Yeah. Which ones? One neighbor probably needs this project more than most. Do we want to go find some other clouds and some other windows? Sam okay. Gosby is a nurse working through the COVID pandemic at the local part. hospital. Ready? Okay. And every day when she gets home, she does the scavenger hunt with her daughter, Thea. Being a nurse, I, it's very stressful being on the front line. Um, when I come home and I get to spend time with my daughter, We'll go this way. It really makes me feel so happy that we have such a positive community and, and there's positivity in such a time that there's so much fear and concern. Do you see any clouds? I yeah. see it. I see it. You see it? Do you want mommy to lift you up? Lots is likely going to change after COVID-19, but <laughs> Sam hopes some good might come from the I pandemic. Might. Good job. What I hope and I feel like this community is doing is we're, is we're getting stronger, we're not getting weaker, and we're not getting scared. We're, we're getting, we're pulling together. So when this is all done, I think it's going to be really awesome because like? our community is just pulling together and not, not being scared. And swing by Ruby's house and you see that sentiment loud and clear. We all have our own part in keeping each other safe by staying home. And we all need to help in, in a way. And so we're all in this together. You know, maybe Ruby's banner is what we need to fly over the whole country right now. Nick Purden, CBC News, Toronto.